Hi there. So my name is Eric Ryan, and in this video, I'm going to share with you our tip number two in this 10 tip series around uh, strategic planning tips for you and your service center. So the second tip is don't lead alone, get a co-champion. And so here's the problem. SPD service center directors are so often just barely hanging on. Uh, this, you, you may not look like this guy, but you might feel like this little guy here. So uh, you're hanging on. You have lots of urgent activities that you have to navigate, such as reporting, reporting deadlines, uh, answering the lead center's requests, managing staff and consultants, running an event or program, executing daily tasks. And you know, as a result of all this, it's no wonder that strategic planning for your center, a simple and focused strategic plan and, and process to execute it, slips through the cracks. Uh, strategic planning is often viewed as uh, uh, an important activity, but not particularly urgent. And so it goes by the wayside. And so what, one of the best tips I can give you as a service center director is to find a co-champion. And we use the term champion here deliberately because it's someone that should have the spirit and the energy of this, not just leading and managing, but saying, hey, let's get the strategic planning process rolling. Let's track it. Let's measure it and so on. So identify someone from your team that can partner with you in that way. And oftentimes that person is an associate director or even an admin. In the case here um, at CSU Bakersfield, the SPDC there, Kelly Bearden, who's been a colleague and friend of mine for years, is a, is a service center director. And Elizabeth, who's his um, Cracker Jack associate director, she's fantastic. Um, but she's a young professional and the two of them work together beautifully. So they work together to make sure their strategic planning process works well. This is one of the most important tips probably in the top 10. If you've got a co-champion that can work with you on this, then you're gonna have a lot more fun. You're gonna have mutual accountability. It's gonna happen a lot more likely that you're actually gonna use the strategic plan. Um, plus it builds depth. Um, if Kelly for some reason wants to retire someday and Elizabeth's still cruising along with this and she can take over and uh, you know, she has already been, incorpor she's been incorporated into the overall process. So um, this is, simple, easy, practical tip um, to uh, help you really um, make your work work well with strategic planning. So don't lead alone, get a co-champion.